This is my book review on the book The Wright Brothers by David McCullough. And I listened to the book on Audible. I listened to the book cover to cover, every word on every page. Um, I'm glad that I chose to listen to the book. Um, not that I don't think that I could have read this book. I think I could have because I enjoyed it enough. But it was beneficial to be able to... Um, listen to it. Um, this book lays out the life of Wilbur and Orville Wright. Um, it tells um, how their dad was a bishop. Um, their mom passed away on July 4th, 1889, and it talks about how um, her death changed um, the meaning of that holiday for them. Not only was it a holiday, but they also um, remembered her death each year. Um, their sister was a college graduate, and I think the book mentions this and puts an emphasis on this because um, Wilbur and Orville were not college graduates, yet they were very successful um, men. Um, one word that I would use to describe the brothers would be entrepreneurs. They... Um, were very creative and they started their own businesses and they were able to take their ideas and um, bring them to life and make it happen um, which is very important because not many people have the chance to do things like that um, they had a bicycle shop when um, riding bikes was very popular so this was in the middle of the change from the high wheeler bi bicycle to the um, safety bicycle which the high wheeler was not safe at all so um, since there was a new safety bicycle everyone was riding and um, Wilbur and Orville enjoyed riding but they also enjoyed um, working on the bikes so they created their own shop they also had a um, print shop where they printed newspapers um, and then they did what they were most known for which is creating the first airplane that could fly and um, in my opinion I do not think that the brothers could have been as successful with creating the um, airplane if they would not have had the experience that they did in the bicycle shop um, working with parts and recreating things and um, I think that knowledge helped them to be so successful with creating and working on the airplane um, I enjoyed this book because I found that I had some a few things in common with um, the Wright brothers this is because from the beginning they didn't know um, that they were going to be creating an airplane you know they did a few different things like I said creating or having a bicycle shop and having a print shop and I think I um, kind of relate to them in a way because I have changed my major um, what well, seems like a million times so um, you don't exactly know it, it's kind of inspiring to see that they didn't exactly know what they were going to do but they were still successful and um, I'm finally on the um, I'm finally at the end of my college career and hopefully I'll be able to be a successful educator in the end so I kind of felt um, I kind of related related to the brothers in that way um, I don't really um, have a critique for the book because I did enjoy the way that David McCullough wrote the book. I think that he made it seem like a story. I enjoy um, reading stories and fairy tales and things like that. So it made it easy for me to listen to the book. And um, that's why I say I also think that I could have read it because it would have been interesting enough um, that I could have sat down and took the time um, to do so um, rather than listening. Um, I think that this book would be inspiring for students to see that you don't have to have a um, set path in life 
Um, but you can be successful if you work hard. Um, I think that fifth or sixth graders could read this book, but I don't think in my classroom I would typically just hand them the book and, you know, say, read this, you have to read this. Um, I think it would be beneficial to um, have a lesson plan where um, these students look at a timeline or create a timeline of the um, Wright brothers' life, showing that, you know, they didn't start off with an airplane in their hand and that's what they did from the beginning. Um, they had a few different paths that they tried to take before creating um, an airplane, which I do, which they did have an interest in it from the beginning, but that's not what they did from the beginning. Um, and then I think that the students could um, use some supplies, like art supplies, popsicle sticks, things like that, to create their own airplane. And um, I think that it would be um, neat to see their ideas and how creative they can be um, in creating the um, their own airplanes. Or they could create one that models the one that the Wright brothers created. Um, once again, I read this book cover to cover, or listened to the book cover to cover, every word on every page, and I did enjoy it, and um, thank you for watching.